Hello friends and welcome to Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to see some of the most basic and widely used Linux commands such as ls, pwd, cd, man and clear commands. Commands in Linux are case sensitive which means capital ls is not the same as lower case ls. ls is a Linux shell command that is used to obtain a list of all the file names in the current directory. With a graphical interface, you do this by opening a folder and inspecting its contents. From the command line, you use the command ls instead to list a folder's content. Now, let us see the ls command in action. So, this is the Ubuntu operating system we are working on. Let us go to the terminal and execute the ls command. In case you cannot locate the terminal, click on this Ubuntu logo here and type terminal. Open the first result and there you go. This is the terminal on which we will be working. By default, we are at the home directly as indicated by the tilde. Now, let us type ls and hit enter. As you can see, these are the files and directories present in my home directory. Let us go to the home directory using the GUI interface. So, this is the home folder and let's see what the contents. So, the contents of the home folder are these, which you can see the same as listed by the ls command. There are a lot of options which can be used with ls to customize the result and we will see them in a separate video. Next is the pwd command. The pw stands for present working directory and as the name says it displays the directory in which we are currently working. Let us see this in action. So let's type pwd on our terminal and hit enter. There you go. Slash home slash user is the directory in which we are working. Now let us suppose that you have to change the directory in which you are working. So we use the cd command for that. cd space the directory name command stands for the change directory and it changes your current working directory in the terminal to the new directory name that you have specified after cd. So let me go to the desktop from the home directory using the cd command. So we type cd space desktop and hit enter. Now we are in the desktop. Let us cross check this by typing pwd to print the working directory. As you can see our present working directory is desktop. Next comes the man command. The man command stands for manual and it can display the inbuilt manual for most of the commands that we need. Let us try opening the manual page for pwd and see what we get. So let me type man space pwd and hit enter. Here is a result. You can see various information regarding the pwd command such as name, synopsis, description, author and various other information. To quit from the manual page, we have to type Q which stands for quit. Now let us see the clear command. The clear command as the name suggests is used to clear the terminal. 
so all the commands which you have typed will vanish. So this is our terminal and let me type clear. As you can see the terminal screen is cleared. That's all for this video. For any doubts or suggestions please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.